just can't sleep tonight. No when Where do you see love? I see love in my parents welcoming me home for Christmas. Okay, I see love in the faces of our team members as we go out to work and we're watching out for each other. We're trying to keep each other safe and we watch out for each other's health. And when somebody doesn't feel very good, then we try to take care of them and just watch to make sure they're not, not getting any worse. Um, we watch to make sure they're, they're safe on the site, that no one's um, doing too much and make sure people are taking breaks when they need it. And we just come to have a real affection and caring for each other and um, somehow being far away from home that also brings us together and helps bond the group. Well, I've seen love, in, of course, in the children with their incredibly smiling faces and even in the people that if it's sunny and they're kind of frowning and you, you say hola, they, they melt and they smile back. But um, at first it bothered me that they wanted to know my name because they just want to make me a pencil and make me try to smart by it. But now I go down the street and all the children are yelling, hi Mimi, hi Mimi, how are you Mimi? <laughs> and then they run up and hug you and this is so irresistible. I mean their love is uh, tangible. Right, where do you see love? I see love everywhere. Um, my husband had a heart and kidney transplant last June and I just saw love in everyone that came and helped us. People from our church that came and babysat Todd, people that brought food over to my family, people that gave us housing in Portland. It, the list is just never ending. It has to do with moving the country block, and we move them from one pile down to where we're building the house. And we get a line going, and we pass the blocks from one person to the other, maybe 20 or 30 or 40 or 50 feet. And next to me in the line was a little nine-year-old girl, and she would look at me and hold her arms out with a smile and take that 25 pound brick and pass it to the next person. That's where the love is. Tonight, someone tell me how to make it.